Bicycle Works. A credit to the northwest of England with their new video, Evangeline. There's a new album from the Smiths, but it's also their last. That's right. The Smiths have officially gone under. Here's the final epitaph. Strange Ways, Here We Come confirms the Smiths as one of the world's all-time greats. The rehabilitation of English pop music in the 1980s was the least of their achievements. It was just a byproduct of their ability to smother structure with content, to transpose emotion directly into sound. Oh yeah, that emotion was grey and uniform, bitter, pitiful, self-indulgent. But knee-jerk evaluation crumples when art reaches this intensity, and that's what the PMRC and our other moral guardians fear most. The Smiths plumbed a rare depth of depression. Only the Velvet Underground, Joy Division, and a handful of others got this far down. But unlike Ian Curtis's cold declarations of agony, Morrissey's obsessions with martyrdom and meaningless death, guilt and heroism, sex and celibacy, catharsis and deceit, they seem almost trite and pretentious. Now, is that sick? Well, where does healthy cynicism end? And how much horror do you have to face up to? The Smiths, prisoners of consciousness. Strange ways, there they go. The latest word is Morrissey is working with Smith engineer Stephen Street and Johnny Morris hooked up with Chrissy Hind and we'll keep you posted. After the break, videos from the Brandos, the Bolshoi and its immaterial. <laughs>